Hello, this is Julia Whittup with Talk Story TV, and we have with us this morning Marilyn Redman. And what are you going to talk to us about today, Marilyn? Whoops, we're losing her. <laughs> That's right. Well, I was reaching for some paperwork. Well, I'm just really excited today because this has been a huge week. My newest book just came out, Finding Reality Beyond Fear. So it's now available on Amazon.com. And I'm going to have my own radio call-in live talk show starting next Tuesday at 3 o'clock Pacific time on bbmglobalnetwork.com. So people can call in with their questions and we'll have guests and all kinds of topics from a wide range of uh, areas that they can talk about and we'll discuss on the air. So everybody's welcome. Okay. And again, that was bbm.com. Uh, let me, well, yeah, right. I, I should have been probably more prepared here. Um, BBM Global Network, and it is, um, I actually have a number of people can, you can't put right down now, 866-451-1451 to call in with your questions so they can get their questions all ready and be prepared for next Tuesday. You want to type that in the chat room for us? A uh, chat room. Yeah, see down at the bottom there's a little menu of stuff there's chat okay you see where it says chat yeah, right okay. okay now you can type something in there all right i shall do that right now eight six six four five one one four five one enter there you go everybody okay so we can go there to listen to it and to ask questions Oh, yeah, that'll work. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so tell us about your new book. Well, I'm really excited. It's um, a book that brings us out beyond what a lot of people have told us in the past. We're moving into new, higher horizons of reality and higher consciousness. It has a, the book has four parts, and the first part is called Finding Grace. As we move out of our denial and our powerlessness, uh, the first chapter explains about that, and then we just each chapter is another step in growing through the principles of love, the principles of the universe. So each chapter, you just as you apply those principles in your life, you kind of are going to grow with the book. And when you get through the first section, you move into finding balance. And each, uh, chap each section in that part is, some people think they're corny, but they're actually slogans that bring a lot of profound truth to your life so you can keep the balance in your life. Instead of lose your track and your path, you can stay on it and proceed more easily and quickly without having to reset your, your goals again, so to speak. So... You know, it's like living more fully is if you're in balance, you are not recreating the old past anymore. You're moving forward and um, one bite at a time. Keep it simple. You know, if you have a lot of projects and people get overwhelmed really easy. So, you know, the old story about how do you eat an elephant one bite at a time. Yeah, huh. I've, had, I've had to learn to do that. And so easy does it. I've always been a real rush, rush, go, go, do 10 things at once person. So all these little slogans have helped me come into a balance in my life that I, I really like today. It's working much better. My life is in more smoothness and mm -hmm. tastes better. I'm not the workaholic overachiever I used to be, <laughs> but I'm, I'm still getting things done because I just do the next indicated thing. Yeah. And, and the rest seems to come together. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. you know, as, as we go through the slogans in the second chat part of the book, uh, it kind of brings me into reality, you might say. And the uh, third part is finding sanity and health. And I've discovered that spirituality is the answer for those things. I've had to come out of uh, nine addictions I've healed violence in my life, especially domestic violence. I've healed mental illness, bipolar disorder, and remnants of, my mother was paranoid schizophrenic. Oh. And I discovered that I, she modeled it very well, and I stepped right into her boots. So um, I've had to heal that, and I've had to um, 
raise my consciousness. And I found a real simple way to help do that. Um, in fact, there's several ways which I want to discuss on my radio show. We're going to do holistic health. App. The first session on my radio show is going to be about um, relationships. And then the next couple sessions, we're going to talk about holistic health. So I'll be glad to tell everybody it's a free, cheap way to raise your consciousness by just using your water and uh, putting, in my case, I have God. Uh, starting out with love and appreciation actually transforms your water and your water by 75% and you can change your life by just changing those vibrations. And so we've got lots of good information in this book and the last chapter brings you into that higher consciousness of the soul. And it talks about the innocence of a child that you have cleaned out your soul. So that innocence is there and your soul can meet the spirit the source of who we are. And it talks about alchemy because that's really the process. You are changing your dense lower energy into a higher consciousness of unconditional love. And when you do that, you know, your soul, and I actually had this in meditation, it's happened several times for me now, um, where I've actually, my soul has met the spirit in the universe. So it's possible to overcome all our difficulties this book is my journey through all the depths and darkness into the light of God or the light of love, however you choose to define that, higher consciousness. And um, it, it's my journey. And if people are interested in the actual how-to details of the more specifics of what I used, then they want to use my book, Paradigm Busters, Reveal the Real You. All my books are on Amazon.com, available for everybody. And so they all deal with this topic of moving and changing our life to be enriched into love, unconditional love. Um, and so each book addresses it from a little different point of view. Wow. How many books have you written? Well, I now have 10 books and that includes eBooks. Wow. And I know what the next one, I have actually two books on the back burner right now I want to write. And I'm really excited about that because I understand what the Bible says from an energy point of view today. Cool. Yeah. Oh, so, we, books. so I am just excited and I have so much information I can help people. I'm thrilled with this radio show coming up. It's called Love Never Fails. And They'll be able to, of course, check out Love Never Fails or my website, angelicasgifts.com. I also have a blog, thanks to you. I'd love to get my newer books up on it, too, at some point. And what I know today is, is that uh, people use a lot of YouTube, so I have 133 YouTubes out there. Wow. Well, some of them we've done together, like the domestic mm -hmm. violence. If people are interested, there's a four-parter we did that I think is superb that more people should be checking into. And I've done a lot of uh, lecturing, and those lectures are on YouTube for domestic violence and spiritual growth. And, you know, interviews that have helped me in various parts of where I've been working on and that part of, of where I am and growing. So... There's a lot of YouTubes out there for people to enjoy. And what's your YouTube channel? Uh, well, they can just find me at Marilyn Redmond. Oh. Marilyn L. Redmond. I discovered on Amazon there's another Marilyn Redmond that's an author. Oh, really? So I have to use Marilyn L. Redmond now. I've changed and added L for my middle initial. So people will know that that's me and not the other writer. Is that correct right there? Will that get me to you? Oh, I don't know. I I just click in because it's automatically repeats on me, but that probably would you probably would work. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm not the techie that you are. So I get it. Whenever I get in, I kind of leave it there and just click. <laughs> 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 but <laughs> if they, <clears throat> Marilyn L. Redmond is, uh, they have lists of um, the different types of interviews I have. And, and I did a lot of channeling. I have quite a few if people are interested in hearing what St. John or John the Divine, as he calls himself in channeling, uh, is interested as far as spiritual information. I, there's a lot of channeling that I've done that's on YouTube. 
And it's all valid information and current today as much as when he gave me the information. You know, spirituality doesn't go out of date. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't, does it? So it's all good information. Okay, so if they just go to YouTube and search for Marilyn Redmond, they'll get a huge... But you, do you have a channel or do you know? <laughs> well... Somebody does it for me, I have to admit. Oh, okay. And they put it up there and say, well, it's on your, they've added it to the list of what's already there. And I just, when I click on YouTube, my computer goes straight to that page. So I'm a little naive about how that works exactly, except that I know you can put in search Marilyn L. Redmond and it will pop up. Okay. Yeah, that might be what you have to do. I'm not being able to get it this way. Okay, well, thanks for being with us today, Marilyn. Well, it's, this is just really fun. I'm really having fun having a chance to do this. So my phone wasn't cooperating. So anyway, I'm just really pleased that people are going to tune in next Tuesday at 3 Pacific time to Love Never Fails, and I'm going to be the hostess. And your questions will be welcomed. We're going to have different topics every week for people to hear probably new information to most people because it's going to go beyond what the medical profession tells us because it's holistic health. Mm -hmm. and it's going to go beyond what people in mental health issues tell us because I've discovered you don't have to be mentally ill the rest of your life. And they necessarily, I had a run in with somebody who's very indoctrinated. You have to take pills the rest of your life. And hey, I've been off all prescriptions for 17 years now and haven't had a drink for 32 years. So, you know, when you detox your system, you can get healthy. Cool. <laughs> Go, and Marilyn. Makes a difference. All right. We'll see you Tuesday. Thanks for calling. Thanks. Bye. Bye bye.